Hello, I'm Robert Grant, and welcome to LearnMyShot.com. Today we're taking our camera outdoors to shoot a close-up of some beautiful flowers. So let's get out there and begin. And here's our setup. I put the flowers in a vase on the table. The lighting's perfect today because it's high clouds with no harsh sunlight. We're starting with a 17 to 85 millimeter zoom lens at the 85 millimeter end of the lens. We're choosing AV, so we select the f-stop and the camera will automatically select the shutter speed. We're selecting 5.6 wide open on this lens to throw the background out of focus. The camera selects 1 40th of a second. Well that's not bad. Our background's out of focus, but let's try something else to make it more interesting. Let's put on a 21 millimeter close-up tube with our 17 to 85 millimeter lens on top of that. And we'll shoot at the 85 millimeter end of the lens. I'm selecting F29 to get a lot of depth of field. The camera selects one-fifth of a second. You need to know that using extension tubes greatly reduces your depth of field. So you need to use a high number to create as much depth of field as possible. This is looking great. We're really getting into the texture and the color of the flowers. Try different angles as well. Don't get stuck in one spot. Make it fun. Let's change the tube to a longer tube, which will get us in closer. We'll go from a 21 millimeter tube to a 31 millimeter tube with our 17 to 85 millimeter lens on top of that. We're going to select F32 as an f-stop, and the camera selects a quarter of a second as a speed, as we know we need a lot of depth of field when using tubes. Well, that's terrific. We're right where we want to be with a beautiful graphic shot. So let's shoot some images here. Well, we hope you enjoyed this video on shooting flowers close up with natural light. And look for an earlier video of ours using close up attachments in the studio with artificial light. And always look for us again at LearnMyShot.com. <laughs>